Uh, that should be everyone. Oh. Hey everyone, you may be allowed to enter. Alright, come on guys, let's go. So, how is this exactly going to work? Well, me and Sonic are gonna go through this computer and input all those letters and numbers into the decoder. Then we're going to use all of this and basically solve the code to that door over there. Yeah, so hope you guys are ready for this. Yeah, I'm ready for it. All right, three, two, one, here we go. Okay, here we go. We have the decoder here. Wait, that's what it looks like? Kinda looks like an arts and crafts thing. <sighs> Guys, come on, focus. Okay. So what do we exactly gotta do? Yeah, cause I'm kinda confused. Well, we have to read out all the numbers and letters, put them on here, and then enter them into a code. Mm, okay. So let's start with, looks like a B. So that would be number six. So let's make sure we have this all down. Let me open up a Google Doc if I can. Okay, so that's the first number. Now what else do we have? We have, hold on, let me check it out. Looks like a D. A D, so that would be eight. Are we even doing this in the right order anyways? Well, it's better to just, you know, see. Yeah, true. Hmm, okay. Next is F, so 11. Oh my God, this computer's so laggy. Monica has the worst Wi-Fi. Jesus, okay. Next, we have three, which would be a question mark. Let's put the question mark there. Here, Sobble, I took some photos to help you out. You can uh, do it off this. Oh, uh, thanks, Birdo. I guess I'll just look into it. Okay, what do we got? Uh, the wheel. All right, here we go. Let's see that back. Wait, what's this, Birdo? Oh, just uh, selfies I took of myself. Uh, why? I don't know, I was just bored. Okay. Uh, yeah, I can see that a lot better. 25. 25 is R. Next. Six. Six is B. Still don't know if we're doing this right. Like, is there gonna be any code? Like, what do we do? I guess I should just get to the next number slash letter. N, all right. N would be 20. Okay, and the next letter, Jesus, why is this so laggy? Uh, maybe we gotta zoom in on this. Huh? What does this mean for to back? That's weird. Maybe it's trying to tell us the code. What could for to back mean? I don't know. Hmm, maybe locations, <sighs> maybe certain places, maybe numbers, letters. Guys, can you tell me where you found all of these? Well, sure. Well, basically, we found, well, I found most of them by like certain places, like a little house on the thing. Me and Marshmallow found mine in a candle, and we also found it in a sofa. Yeah, that's true. Me and a skid found ours in like a dining room. Hey, I was in that dining room. Oh, that's nice. Yeah, we were... Were you, like, on the bottom? Yeah. Yeah, it was, like, really cool seeing there. It was, like, very spooky down there. Yeah, and we loved it. Uh, I found mine in the kitchen. Same. What was that meaning that? 
I don't know, that's odd. Okay, the next one is... <coughs> uh, huh? Well, 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 well. Well, 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 well. I see right here that you're on the computer. Where did you even find this? Sonic found it. Yeah. Your point? <sighs> you know, I can't believe the mastermind would be so nice with this motive. Hmm. What a shame. <sighs> Say goodbye to your freedom. This motive is no longer able to use. Wait, what? I don't care. Now, you can do whatever you want for the rest of the day, but this motive is now no longer able to use. If I catch anybody putting any code in there, without murder or anything, then yeah. The only thing you left could do is kill. Well, anyways, see you later. Uh, didn't you forget to take the computer? Huh? Uh, it's not opening! Oh, crap. So, he really meant this motive was over? We can't escape now? Wh what? How does that make sense? Well, I guess we should just go back. To normal, I guess. Yeah. But guys, we can't give up. Well, there's nothing we can do. Yeah! Hmm. I guess there's not. Well, I guess since I can't do anything about the motive, I better just do the rest of my free time before going to bed. <coughs> oh, hey, boyfriend. Hey, what's up? Not much. Just don't know what to do after thinking about that. Hmm. You want me to play you a bit of a... You know, show. I guess that could work. All right. Boyfriend show ended up cheering me up a little bit. I mean, we felt like we couldn't escape, but it made me escape from reality and helped me out and made me feel better. So what did you think? I thought it was pretty good. Oh, thanks. No, thank you for helping me. Huh? What do you mean by that? Well, I felt a little bit sad, but I feel a bit happy now. Oh, you're welcome. Thank you, boyfriend. Keith. Huh? Call me Keith. That's my real name. I just go by boyfriend because I'm just trying to, you know. Oh. So you're just looking for love? Pretty much. That's why I've been rapping my whole life. Because I'm trying to impress all my girlfriend's desires and everything. Oh, okay. Well, thank you, Keith. You're welcome, Sobel. Well, might as go check on Grim Foxy. Boo! Ugh! The skin, what are you doing? Oh, nothing much. I'm just trying to get into the spirit of Spooky Mom. Aren't you always in the spirit of Spooky Mom? Yeah, pretty much. Why'd you hide in a pumpkin out of all things? Because he's my brother. Mm, true. Is that all you wanted to do? Pretty much. Okay, see you later, I guess. See you later, Zabble. That was pretty odd, but anyways. All right, everyone. Huh? That sounds like Sonic. What would he want? Okay, what's up? Huh? What's everybody doing here? Oh, uh, Sonic was just announcing something. Uh, what is it, Sonic? Well, I'm not saying I don't trust you guys, but... I'm not exactly sure that since Monokuma disbanded the motive of being able to go over there and use the code, we're gonna have to keep security eye on it. What do you mean by that? Yeah, I don't understand fully. Well, what we're gonna have to do is we're gonna have to have people guard the door for a two hour period. Two hours, isn't that long? Well, what else can we do? So first, I'll be going at 10 o'clock tonight, and uh, oh, there you are, Bonnie. Hey, what's up? 
Wait, Mommy, what are you doing here? I thought you had to check over Grim Foxy. Well, I did, but right now he's doing fine, so... What is this about? We gotta hurry up. Okay, so I was going to watch out at 10 o'clock the door because since there needs to be a code introduced, but since nobody can open that anymore because Monokuma disbanded the motive, we have to make sure nobody opens it. Not like anybody even got the code anyways. Yeah, that is true. Um, we just gotta take precautions. Okay, then what next? I thought Birdo could go. Wait, why me? Because you have a phone. It's like surveillance. Oh, okay. Then what about you, Marshmallow? Um, are you sure? Trust me, you'll be fine. And then, I guess we'll choose... How about... Me. Huh? That voice we heard, it ended up shocking us all to see who it was. You heard me. What? Grim Foxy, shouldn't you be in bed? Don't worry, Bonnie. I'll be fine. You've taken good care enough for me for enough. Now, it's time to help out my friends. Grim Foxy, are you sure about this? Yeah, man, like... You sure? Yeah, I'm sure. I could probably help you guys out even on it. Okay, and I guess you can go at six o'clock, Sobble. No, I won't allow that. I'm not having Sobble go that early. Don't worry, Gurki, I'll be fine. Sobble, you're actually sure about this? You gotta be careful. Yeah, so does the rest of us. And then we'll do the next night and we'll choose different people. Fine. I'm going to bed then. Yeah, same. Good night, Sobble. <sighs> well, probably should just get started ready. Anyways, Monokuma's alarm is about to go off and... There it is. Attention, students. It is now 10 o'clock a... Sorry, p.m. Anyways, go to bed. All right. See you guys later. We'll see you in the morning. Uh, I wonder what's gonna happen. Well, I better get ready for tomorrow morning. <laughs> Six o'clock a.m., gotta wake up, guard the door. You can do this, Sable. You can do this. Uh, it must be six o'clock. Monokuma's morning announcement should come on in an hour, but I hope everybody finished their shifts and did a good job. Guess it's my turn. Yeah. Well, huh? Why is that light on? That's odd. Well, <sighs> better as well just, I don't know, continue on and on and on. Everything looks pretty clear so far. Ah! Ow! Ah, my foot. Ah. Ah, that hurts. Wait. What's over there? Looks really blurry. What? What is that? Wait. No, that's not what I think it is. Huh. No. No. Why? Why is this happening to us? When we finally thought we had a chance to escape. And when we tried to benefit that escape. It looked like that any way we would go would turn into a whole pile of despair. saw the dead body of the ultimate glass shatterer marshmallow, I realized that I was stepping in a piece of bloody glass.